Janitor stuff. Progress the same as yesterday. That's the rapport. All right. It's going to snow today. Let's go find Yosuke. We'll do his uh, evolution persona business. What the hell is he? Isn't he usually on the second floor? Maybe you can't hang out with him today? That would be a bummer. Maybe he's at Juness? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe at least Teddy's there. Yeah, Teddy's here. Sensei. We'll do his then. We're going to the ocean. I guess. Teddy, you realize it's like 20 degrees outside. This is not a good place to go. The salt was actually me sweating. It's tough to skate against the wind. Wow, the winter sea is really cool too. I wonder how we actually got to the ocean. Like, did I have to like tow him behind me on my scooter? <laughs> Coming here with everyone was fun, but it's exciting to be here alone with you too. This must be the true charm of the winter sea. Sensei, over here! Let's do that thing people are supposed to do on the beach and run around in the surf! Come on! Try and catch me! It's like, oh, what have I got myself into? Sensei, why is the sea so huge? The world. I know what that is. It's where everything is, and everything in it is connected. The sea sparkly. I didn't know anything about anything until I met you and everyone else. Fun things, feelings that make me want to cry. How the sea is so beautiful. I didn't know anything. And I never thought about wanting to learn, either. I can feel all kinds of things in me now. All these feelings created after I met all of you. I think that's my life. It's these different feelings that keep me going. There's still tons of things I don't understand. And I don't know what I'm going to do from here, either. But... I've decided that I'm going to do the best with this life that I can. Even though I was scared, I took a step forward and discovered such a wonderful, shiny world. That's why you too, Sensei. S sen sensei! <laughs> Teddy, your tears are going to freeze. Because you're going away soon, I want you to know, Sensei. But I felt like if I told you, then you'd leave for good. I'm out, or I'm going now. <laughs> how, how long is that in Topsicles? <laughs> if I stop eating them, will it never come? I don't think that's a frame of time there. <laughs> but I'll be okay. It's sad, but being sad is part of life, too. I've made my decision to stop relying on you so much, Sensei. I will now enter the independent Teddy chapter of my life. <laughs> so that this time, I can be your Sensei. I'm like a spaceship with a missile stuck in my butt.
Anything could happen. <laughs> I think I tried that once when I was using Teddy in one of my playthroughs, and like I just like damaged the entire team or something really dumb. Holy moly! Something came out. I'm an all new model now, Teddy version three, or is it four? Maybe I should study counting first. <laughs> oh, but even though I've entered my independent phase, I'm still gonna have Yosuke take care of me. I'm not that independent yet. And he's still gonna come home with me. <laughs> oh, Sensei's home. We were just together. <laughs> Thanks, Teddy. I'm gonna go work as the janitor again. What kind of wacky things are going to happen here? Ooh, drama. Well, that was something. <laughs> Goodbye now. All right. Snow clouds. Whoa. <laughs> Dang it. That's right. Why are you asking me about like alcohol and stuff? I'm a high schooler. It's inappropriate teach. Alright, let's see if we can find uh Yosuke. Yep, okay. Then after this, we'll start hanging out with Risei Kanji Nauto. Yo! See if we can't bump those guys up to max. We're gonna have a fight with Yosuke again? It's been a while since I last talked to you one-on-one -on -one like this. It's been pretty busy in the department I work in. I'm still doing that consultation thing, too. I caused you some trouble, too, with that message, Juness. Really? <laughs> That's good to know. Back then, I was constantly irritated, wondering why that stuff was happening to me. I was overworked just because I was the store manager's son, and on top of that, tons of people took me for granted. I thought no one was thinking about me. But that's not how I feel now. I took a roundabout way realizing this, but one constant in my life is that people rely on me. I thought before that I was shameless for being like that, but I just don't mind it. When I'm doing things for other people, it helps me try harder. When Nanako-chan was kidnapped, didn't you think I was surprisingly on top of things? Nah. Were you? <laughs> Come on, at least say I helped a little. Oh, wait, you're right. 
I wasn't thinking much when I said stuff like we should drop Namatame in, huh? I guess I wasn't so reliable. In any case, I tried pretty hard at the time. Of course, I was serious about wanting to save Nanako-chan and solve the case. But mainly, it was because I thought you were going through some tough times. When we were debating dropping Namatame into the TV, I was just seeing red. I was so overwhelmed with hate and wanting to blame everything on him that I stopped thinking for myself. I think the same could be said about what happened to Juness. People just think about their own interests. But if I ignore them and say it's none of my business, I won't get anywhere. I'll forget what's important, and I won't be able to be proud of myself. I won't be able to say I did my best. I want to keep pushing myself like that. I want the people I care about to be happy. You get cool shoes and a huge fireball afro. That's how you, that's how you, uh, evolve. Let's see here. Moderately restores party's HP and raises hit evasion rate for three turns. Put that over diorama. Is this for real? There's a lot I'm grateful for from this past year. But the biggest thing, I think it was that I met you. If you ever lose your way, I'll go knock some sense into you. It won't matter if you're at the ends of the earth or in somewhere dark and bleak. That's what partners are for, right? I'll knock you instead. <laughs> that makes no sense. We're talking about if you start screwing up and your punches hurt. I'll never lose my way if it'll keep me from feeling those again. I just, I just want to punch Yosuke anytime. You're home. I'm home. What's up? Oh. I just talked to him. He didn't mention a word about you. All right, let's make envelopes or do something. There we go. Sunday fun day. Yeah, it's me. Like he's like, yeah, we're coming on the twentieth. All right, later. <laughs> Book of the Void and a giant candy bead chain. I think I'm gonna get a bead chain. That sounds very useful. Let's go see who wants to hang out.